Hi, it's day 16 of Amy B's Cancer Diaries, and today I just wanted to discuss the cost of cancer. Now, we've probably all seen news stories and documentaries about the expense of cancer, um, and it's true. It's very, very expensive. Right now, I'm actually waiting to see if I can get approval for a pill that I need to take every day. And in the meantime, cancer tumors are growing in my lungs and my pelvic bone while we wait to see if uh, my insurance decides to approve the uh, drug. And when I first got diagnosed, I had to stop working because I underwent severe chemotherapy. And uh, there's a six-month waiting period before you can get any disability where they have to verify everything. For six months, I didn't have any income coming in, yet somehow I still had to pay all of my bills and rent and everything like that. Um, and then I was on Obamacare, and you have to wait two years before you get Social Security. And then um, it's Social Security Disability. And then along with that, you usually have to buy a prescription plan because chances are you are going to be on some sort of prescription for the rest of your life. Different prescriptions along the way, which of course have different costs. Um, these are just like bills that I have. I just want to read you some of the stuff that I owe. Uh, $16.07, $477.80. 4613, 2412, $445.88, $1,367.37, $4,924.87, $529.15, and the list goes on and on. I basically keep them in chronological order. Um, I am grateful that the hospital that I go to actually has a financial assistance program where you can look into getting some financial assistance and they base that on your income or sometimes you can pay in increments just depending on um, what kind of services are available at the hospital. So again, if you have cancer or if you are a caretaker for someone that has cancer, and you are in financial straits, which chances are you probably are, uh, please be sure to check with your hospital about any sort of financial programs they may have. And they also may have a social worker that may be able to direct you to some outside sources for some assistance financially. So take a look at that. Cancer co the cost of cancer is completely outrageous and uh, something needs to be done.